Hello YouTube, I'm using my ES57 XLR microphone, and this is going to be a really quick video. Um, I'm not going to go into too much depth, I'm just going to show you real quick over here on the left side of the screen. So you can see over here, I'm going to show you this right here, this right here, I'm like moving my mouse over here on the left side of the screen. This right here is the cable that I'm using right now, it works perfectly no matter what the reviews say. So I'm using this kind of cable. It works perfectly. It, it works on pretty much everything. I'm just saying, and I'm using a Mac, obviously, and um, I'm using GarageBand because I don't have a Windows computer and I don't use Windows stuff a lot. So yeah, and plus I know how to run this so much better. So what we're gonna do, like you can buy that. It's better than having to go buy something like 50 bucks or $100, like all these converters. But let's say you bought the Icicle, and, or someone bought it for you, and you already had the XLR to XLR cable, and you plugged it into the Icicle, and it went into your computer. But you still didn't have any earphone access. This right here works for anyone who doesn't have earphone access, but has a computer. So yeah, make sure it's USB going into your computer if it's not too bad you gotta have a usb so the best bet is just to go buy one of these cables like i said 10 bucks or so it's cheap and it's affordable and reliable so there you go so now we're gonna go to GarageBand, and we're gonna i'm gonna show you how to do what i was talking about like how to hear yourself while recording so here we go Go into GarageBand. It should pick up this microphone. Uh, yeah, it's already picked it up. But let's say your microphone has not been picked up. It will probably pull up in the middle of the screen. Your microphone has not been picked up. So what I'll do is go up here to the top thing. Like, let's say, like, it, it should say your microphone was picked up. It should, say, it should ask, do you want to do this PNP or whatever your thing is called. Mine's called PNP. So you go up here to GarageBand. After it asks you that, no matter what, just go up here to Preferences. Go to Audio MIDI. Make sure that, the, like, usually right when you get it, it'll be set on, it'll be set like this. It, both of them will be coming out and in and out the same thing. The thing is, this device does not have headphones. But if it does, just select yes on that one. The output, you want to use the built-in output if you don't have headphone option. So there you go. That's all you need to know. And now you can see up here in the top left corner, yeah, it's doing that because it picked up. And I can turn on my monitor and hear myself. So yeah. And this right here is perfect i can hear myself clearly at this like it's no feedback no nothing it's perfect sound um so yeah so all you gotta know on this and and never have to um buy something expensive again yeah just buy this cable and you'll be buying better stuff than just like buying a expensive xlr cable and then buying an interface or something an adapter and then buying the usb cable you got all that in one right here so yeah thanks guys for watching um like and subscribe and i'll see you guys later bye